8 Foods That Are Mood Killers Number 1. Licorice Hormonal imbalances and changes result from eating too much of this candy, severely impairing sex drive. This happens for both men and women. It also happens to be disgusting, so chances are your partner isn't eating it anyway. Number 2. Alcohol Yes, alcohol is responsible for countless hookups, but it isn't what you would call sex friendly. In fact, alcohol is known to stifle erectile function and also inhibit orgasm. Think twice before having a drink if you want to take things all the way. Number 3. Caffeine You mean caffeine, the stuff we drink all day long can ruin our sex drive? The truth is, as a stimulant, caffeine encourages dehydration and anxiety. That's a losing combination in the bedroom. Number 4. Soybeans We love to munch on edamame while eating sushi and new health trends are coming up with more soy products than we can imagine, but did you know it's a libido killer? For centuries, monks have eaten soybeans to curb sexual urges. Number 5. Corn Flakes there may not be much modern credence to this being a mood killer, but its inventor had just that idea in mind when he created the breakfast food. John Harvey Kellogg decided that it was boring and bland enough to distract people from their frisky side. Number 6. Graham Crackers In the 1820s, Reverend Sylvester Graham thought things were getting a little too risque for his tastes. Picture exposed ankles and women shaking hands with no gloves on. He decided to keep his flock docile by filling them with this flowery and bland snack. The only way to save these things is to cover them with melted chocolate and marshmallow. Number 7. Cilantro. Eastern religious monks use cilantro to calm their more amorous urges. This is kind of funny, because during the Middle Ages cilantro was used as a key ingredient in love potions. I bet there were a lot of disappointed suitors back then. Number 8. Opioids. While technically not a food, many opioids are ingested. Antidepressants can also counteract our sex drive and are horrible mood killers for amorous lovers. Don't stop taking any medication you need, but keep in mind the effect it can have on your love life.